What's up and welcome to another episode of Kicking It With Moats. And we gotta talk about a sneaker collab that is dropping soon. In fact, it's dropping the 22nd of May. And I am super excited about it. I'm talking about the Air Jordan 3, J Balvin collabs, the Rio colorway. Man, listen. The Medellin Sunsets dropped last year. Cobb those, loved them, all right? But of course, when you go give me the same Jordan 3 with some of those same cool quality, you know, the, the little details of it, but now you would give it to me in black? Oh, yeah, I, I don't feel like I have a choice. I feel like it's mandatory for me, all right? So let's talk about it. Hit that like button on the front end. Don't forget to subscribe, all right? Like I said, man, dropping May 22nd, retailing at a price of $250. They are gonna be dropping on the Nike sneakers app. Fingers crossed, good luck, you know the drill. Yeah, pray to your sneaker guys, do whatever you need to do, yeah. Hold your lucky goldfish, all right? Because it's a crapshoot with that. But um, select retailers across the world. Up. And obviously, man, when we're talking about the Rio, the big thing that stands out with the sneaker is the black colorway. Um, like I said, man, very different than the Medellin Sunset that had that lighter hue. It's definitely a lighter shoe just all together. But on the back of it, you can obviously see that beautiful J Balvin logo with the smiley face love that that's one of the big staples with the sneaker and then obviously on the other side you got your nike air branding but you get your little lightning details on it as well love that then of course like any traditional jordan 3 on the toe box and on the hill you got that lovely cement print you love to see that but instead of it being in a traditional you know lighter gray or elephant colorway we obviously got that darker uh hue to it obviously going perfectly with the sneaker and then of course on the bottom this is where they call it the solar flare shout out to the solar flare all right yeah but beautiful beautiful man in terms of the details on it and the inspiration for j balvin in terms of the sneaker he talked about uh his son yeah he said uh the birth of his son was uh you know a, a light in him that was the light to his darkness is kind of how he phrased it and he ultimately said the shoe is kind of that depiction and you kind of get that man when you look at the base of the shoe and even the heel part where it is a little bit of that light starting to come up and you know ultimately overtake the darkness man i love that so for me whenever you give me a dope jordan 3 plus it being a collab and then i got this cool story behind it as a father as well, I got my own little man. Shout out to G Money. I obviously see him on the show or on the channel plenty of times, man. It's definitely something that I could support. Definitely something that I can relate to. So, like I said, man, I'm going to definitely cop them. But just quickly, man, as we compare and contrast, man, obviously I told you I had the Medellin Sunsets. So, you can just see the difference, right? Obviously, with the Rios, we blacked out, right? But this is how we get it in with the Medellin Sunsets, man. All right, like I said, I think it's a beautiful sneaker. Obviously, the selling point on the back of this, you still got that right there. But then, like I said, on this side, you're gonna have a little bit of those lightning bolts, right? Obviously, on the tongue, you still got the Jumpman logo, and I almost dropped the shoe. Both, in terms of the Rios and the Medellin Sunsets, they come with. The nice little uh, badge with his logo, the smiley face with the lightning bolt eyeballs. All right. For me, man, I just I don't really like a lot of bulky stuff like hanging off the shoe like that. So that's ultimately why, I, you know, I nixed it. But for some people, man, hey, rock out with it, baby. Rock out with it. But like I said, man, that's the compare and contrast. All right. But uh, like I said, man, for me. Definitely got to go ahead and pull up on these Rios, man. So you guys let me know your thoughts, though, on the J Balvin uh, Jordan 3 Rio, the black colorway. If you like it, what stands out to you about them. And if you're going to try your hand at getting them, like I said, man, May 22nd, all right? Retailing at $250 Nike sneakers at, baby. May the odds be of it in your favor, all right? But either way, you know I appreciate you for tuning in. And until next time. Just remember to rock your heat.